Welcome to Fast Time Tech. My name is Teddy and tonight we are looking at a Philips VCR DVD combo. It is model number DVP3355V slash F7. And that's like the fourth time I've done a take on this to get through just seeing the model number. So bear with me here, please. All right, let's look around at the back because I want to prove to everybody that that is indeed the model number because that's crazy. Let's first take a look at what we have here. Um, we have, um, uh, so we, we have, uh, first of all, our audio, we have a digital audio out. We have um, for, um, what do you call it? For, we have uh, I, I, also for, for the DVD only side, we have our own audio, just regular um, composite audio out. We have an S video and then we have a component video right here which is like i i've said before kind of the start of um of getting into hd now for in order for the um for the for the vcr and dvd both to work on the same um audio and video out we have the composite jacks which i have these composite cables plugged into and then we also have uh we have an out a set of out also, which it says here is just for the VCR. That's interesting. I guess so you, you could, I don't know. I don't know why that is actually. That's a little bit beyond my knowledge. All right, and here's the tag. And there, right there is the model number that was a mouthful. Crazy, right? All right, so yep, we have a Philips here. Now it does very much look like uh, a particular model of Funai. Uh, for I made Magnavox model. Um, I'm not going to deny that. I just don't see the word Funai on here. So, but I'm sure it was made by Funai. So anyone that's going to post that in the comments, like thinking they got one on me, no, I'm, I'm probably it was made by Funai. All right. So let's go back around to the front to have the show. All right. So make uh, I gotta say the remote though for this looks much different than the Funai the Funai made um, Magnavox, um, crazy differences here. Let's turn this unit on. Um, it looks like it looks like it's got a piece of hair right here, but this is a scratch. So, anyways, let's go ahead and eject the tray, and then we'll test the um, the, the what do you call it the uh, uh, DVD side. I think I have to have it on DVD first. There, yeah. I could have done that on the remote. In fact, I'll do it on the remote too. I'll go back to VCR, then go to DVD. Yeah. So there you go. And I didn't even get the DVD out. I am a little bit a little bit off my game here, but let me just grab it right now. Well, while I show nothing on the screen. My video, let's see. Can I save this video? I think I, I, I can save this video. There we go. Okay. All right, I saved it. Uh, you can leave in the comments whether I saved it or not. You can tell me. If I didn't save, I had too many, too much, too much. I usually have all that laid out right there. And as you see, I had to grab it and just pull it out real quick. So sometimes I just feel like I pull these videos, just pull them out, you know, <laughs> out of what? No, I'm not going to say that. All right. So anyways, there you go. The uh, DVD side works. Perfect. It's a little loud for my taste, but it works. Okay. So now I'm going to go ahead and eject that. Open, close on the remote. Did hit it yet? All right, I'm gonna get that off to the side here. Not even where it should go. Okay, not even back in the case. Okay, now we're gonna switch this over to the VCR side, which is like the main show here. For that, I have Independence Day. We'll watch a little bit of that. All right, let's get that in there. So I'm gonna use the remote for this. It's, I didn't really study up on how to fast forward and stuff, but I think I got it. There we go. All right, so I brought that up. I must have louded the volume at some point. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna demonstrate that this unit can um, can change mode, so we know that the gears and the electronics are working in sync properly. Okay, so this is play. Let's do play fast forward. Good. Let's hit play again. That looks great. The picture looks great too. All right, let's do uh, play rewind. Oh, I like that. There's that little black and white thing too. And let's hit play again. A little black and white thing because you're going into the past. Although I have to say on some models, I'm, I'm sometimes afraid that it's going to stay black and white, like something went wrong, right? 
All right, I'm gonna hit stop and I'm gonna do um, some play fast forward. Let rev up. There we go. Stop. Play. Yep. If I play too much of this audio, it will it'll flag me for a copyright violation. So sorry, folks. As much as I, I love that speech, I love that speech more than uh, most of the speeches that any of our presidents have ever given in my lifetime. All right. I'm going to now rewind, show that this, this unit rewinds, 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 rewinds properly. Can't even talk. So we have it revved up. I've got people often say in the comments, I don't let it rev up enough. I'm worried about the length of my video too much, so we got it. All right, let's hit play. There we go. I, hey, I nailed that. That's a break back where we started from, right there. Perfect. Okay, uh, I'm gonna hit pause. Okay, hit pause. I'm gonna stop, and then I am going to. Is, can you eject from the remote? I don't know. You can open and close, but there's no eject button, so that's okay. We'll uh, just eject from uh, here, from here. All right, let's make sure it didn't need tape. All right, there we go. Now let's put in the Terminator to finish it off. I always like to switch tape so we know that, uh, hopefully not finish it off, but we, we, we just, we know that it switch tapes and all works well and everything's fine. All right, so let's get on with that now. Okay, there's Terminator. All right, there we go, we got that. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit stop. I'm gonna eject that now. And I just wanna comment that this unit is in really great shape. Looks beautiful on the on the top. It's got a few spots over on the, like here that like, I, I thought it was dust at first, but then they're not really, I mean, they're, they're like very superficial scratches. Let me get that, that in focus. Um, and then we got that, that, that piece that looks like cat hair, dog hair. That's just, it's just another scratch. It's got, it's got some scratches on it, right? So it's got some scratches on it. Now I didn't, you know, I always, always, um, always like to say a fun fact, um, with these units, right? And I, I didn't get, I didn't, I didn't get a chance to say this one up front because I guess I got distracted, um, by the model number. But uh, and I don't want to make this a permanent feature of my videos, but I have to say that this unit sells for six hundred twenty-five dollars on Amazon. Now I mean that that's an unopened box, new one. So, I mean, you know, I guess if you want to, like the brand new one doesn't have the little fine scratches on it and stuff like that, which you don't know, you don't know if it works or not, you know, it's, it's like, it could be a defective one that you, that you bought in brand new in the box from, you know, 2015. So I, I believe that tag said that this was made in 2015. Um, but that's just, wow. In fact, oh, oh my goodness. Did we, did we miss that on the tag? Did we miss that? Yes, it does indeed say. It says July 2015 on it. Man, how did I miss that? Because that's always been fa my favorite thing to show on the tags is is the year it was made. So yeah, this was made in 2015. So that's like, whoa, that's five, seven years ago. That's not so long ago. This probably is the end of making these, I imagine. So yeah, $625 for, for one of these that's brand new in the box. And Amazon says they only have one left. So if you want to buy it from Amazon, you know, hurry up. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah. Um, so if you, if you want to purchase this unit from me, because you know it works and I've, I've, you know, I've tested it and you trust me, go down in the description below and there's a link to eBay and then go ahead. I, I, I have it priced very similar to what the used price is on Amazon because the, these units are apparently in demand. Um, yeah, um, if you like this video, which I can't imagine why because I, I kind of messed this one up, but uh, if you like this video, please um, like, comment, subscribe. Uh, and if you are in the market for tech, which is past its time, come back and see what I feature next. Have a great day or evening.